What you got? What you got to ask me? Since you've been in this business, what's your most memorable moment or your most wildest story? That's you so got? hard. Oh, my God. One story. That you wildest story. <laughs> Some of that I can't talk about on camera. I know. I'm sitting here thinking, like, what is the wild? The wildest story? Damn. Um, I'm, um, I just told this, well, that ain't really wild. I don't know, like, I got a lot of stories. I'm trying to think, like, it's been a lot, it's been a lot that's happened in the last 15 some years, so, um, I'll tell my Kanye story. So, um, I was interning at Vibe, and I always tell this story, but it's always, I, I, I can tell it over and over again. I was interning at Vibe, I was in New York, and um, I had met Kanye like a little bit before I went out there, and uh, I ran into him on the train out there in New York, and I was like, aren't you from Chicago? He like, yeah. I'm like, me too. Cause I had seen him at Columbia. This is when I was still going to Columbia. And he was like, what you doing out here? I'm like, well, I'm interning at Vibe. He like, man, can you get me in Vibe? I'm like, well, bro, I'm a intern, but I try, forget it. We from Chicago, I'm, I'm gonna try to help you get in, into Vibe, fuck it. So I go to, go to uh, work or whatever, same old. And I went and talked to the, the music editor and I asked her, did she know who Kanye was? I had My boss sent me down there for something. And so I went down there and I was like, um, do you know who Kanye West is? She was like, yeah, I know who Kanye West is. I was like, yeah, you know he just produced. And he like gave me the whole speech on what I need to tell her, everything. He told me, tell her I just did the blueprint. I got four songs on Jay-Z new album. He tells me the whole spiel. And so I'm like, all right, cool. I'm going to tell her exactly that. Now, this is when Two Ways was out. So that just lets you know how long ago this was. So he says, so I go down there. I go down there. I, I, I just literally, I was going down there to get a, a CD. And I just stopped and was like, hey, do you know who Kanye West is? She was like, yeah. And so I tell her, I said, hey, you guys should do a story on him. He's from Chicago. He's done this. He's done that. He's about to be on Jay-Z's new album, X, Y, and Z. And she turns to me and she says, yeah, I know he is, but I don't think he's relevant enough. And so I went back, sent him the message, and I told him to call me. And um, I, I told him exactly what she said. And it was one of those things where he was like, all right, all right, like, I'm going to show her pretty much. Well, I'm going to show vibe. And I didn't necessarily... I don't know if I told him which editor it was, but that's where the It Takes More Than a Magazine to Kill My Vibe line came from. I'm convinced because Vibe was like the last magazine. I don't know if y'all remember, he was doing every interview and he did not do Vibe for a long time. And I remember he came back to Chicago and did a quick concert at the House of Blues and he did this long rant about fuck Vibe, this and that. Like, and I was laughing because... I was the one who delivered that message to him. And just in general, like me and him had so many encounters after that. Like the day my sister passed, he had his platinum party when college dropout went platinum. And like she died in the same car, like the same way he got into the car accident, same exact way. And so like my friends dragged me out to the party. He sat there and talked to me for like 15 minutes and we just talked because the same thing had just happened to him, you know, or whatever. So he was real messed. Like, he just sat there and hung out with me and just talked to me and just was like, why are you outside? I was like, look, I don't want to be here. But my friends dragged me out. But um, I got story up on story up on story. I got stories about artists not showing up to stuff. Um, my first encounter with Raekwon and how, you know, somebody fake fake booked them and they, they hadn't booked them. And and I had to literally bring them in town. I got tons of stories of just all type of stuff. Um, how most deaf lost his phone one day when he was here at the shrine. It was, I got all type of stories. I could talk about that all day, but 
That's one story. Is that enough? You want another one? What's the word? What's the word? What's the word? I'm stepping now. What's the word? 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 Hey, what's your time? See your prayer.